Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome to another episode of Craft the World. Um, between last episode and this one, Mrs. Rambler dropped the hint that if you hit Control R, it sends all of the dwarves to sleep that need it. And that got me thinking, there must be key bindings here somewhere. I hit options and it just gives you a couple of volumes and that's about it. Full screen and, and that's all. So that didn't do me any good. So I hit the Craft the World wiki and found out that uh, yeah, Control R sends dwarves to, to bed and, and Control E sends starving dwarves to eat. But most importantly, P makes a pause. Woohoo! I don't have to do this anymore. Okay, and I can even move it while it's paused. Oh, that makes life so much easier. Because I can now say, this time we're going to work on fixing this situation finally. Um, probably by, well, temporarily, either knocking one of these down and putting it somewhere else. Or, um, I guess building another one just to get this cleared out and then put it back together again. Problem is, we're too high. So we can't reach what we need to. I could, I guess, put a row of, of ladders all the way across here and then finally get rid of this. Although he's come down a little bit. I wonder if I can reach him now. Can't click him. Okay. Anyway, we need to deal with this. We need to deal with this. She said that in her game, that thing just suddenly opened up one time and a bunch of chaos stepped through and she wasn't very far into the game. I'm thinking this is a late game thing. Apparently, I'm thinking wrong. And then we need to get some mining done. Normally by now, I've gotten a lot more mining done. Oh, hello. There's more of them. Hmm. The map kind of expanded a little on me. Here's a mini map down there. Then what? We learned last time that four blocks deep doesn't deter them from trying to bust through. So... Trying to maintain this is not necessarily going to stop anything from happening. It's going to take them a lot longer to get through, and that's good. Hopefully we can get out here and, and you know, get their attention before they get past layer 3. But it means that I don't have to worry as much about trying to maintain it as I was thinking of. So, in fact, what I might do, we just close this off completely and start make this our first layer through. Maybe we need to be like eight blocks deep. And we'll fill this back in again. But it means that I think I can take this layer and put it down here. So instead of putting a force layer over the top, let's just put it down as this first layer of stone. And that way the catapult guy isn't now sending him off up into here even. So that's that's something to think about. Also I want to see about maybe making this a little more creative maybe at this point you know get rid of this right here make this the next stair steps in and maybe send up two towers or something something a little different eventually we're gonna get brick and then stone so we may be going through and replacing all this wood with something else just to make it look different but that's not uh, super important right at this moment so where to start in all of that also I've kind of lost the habit of looking down at my notes last three or four episodes I've had all kinds of, of uh, uh, notes here telling me what to do and I haven't even glanced at them so I want to lower the forest I want to deal with the door get some mining going we need some more more uh, iron and we're gonna need well, we're gonna need lots of stuff so we got to get down in there this goes quite a way it's actually this goes far down as I'm thinking I don't usually run the small map so I'm used to something going much further than this so yeah we're gonna get through the series a lot sooner than uh, and uh, what the game that I'm used to playing. Uh, move the forge and deal with the the upper area up here. Okay, so let's get that going. They're off. Okay. So, can I attack him? If not, can I tear these down? They're not afraid of him right now. Okay, well, we've got one forge down at least. I'll leave that one. We only need one. Let's pick it up and leave. And where to put the forge? He's got it right now. Now, is this door open now? It is open. Okay. That was a huge mistake. Episode and a half of this door being sealed. I was blaming them. Boy, I was blaming them. 
Anyway, let's go up with a layer of stone and a layer of wood, like so. Like that. You come out, you're going to be stone. We're going to stone the outside, wood the inside. We're going to put another door here to make a double door. In fact, while they're only wood, I think I'll put a triple door. And later when we get to iron doors, I'll take it back to a double door. That sounds about right. We do now have ten people and six, seven, eight beds. Six. Yeah, we're missing another bed. So we've got to get we got to get some beds made. And temporarily, let's go ahead and do it in here. We'll move them later. So craft. And the only beds that I can make right now are still these. But let's make three more. Move those down into there. And shall we get them out of the uh, the ground? Out of here. Don't know. You can't get through to what? You can't get outside. Yeah, that is a problem. Normally what I do... Well, not normally. What, usually the what I would do... Um, the last couple of games I played, I, I did this sort of thing. Normally I would do everything down below. And I have just a little building up on the, on the ground with a door here and a door there. They go up and leave whichever direction they want. Now I've learned to kind of stone myself in but it does make it difficult to move around so that's right I forgot about that we've got bridges that we could use craft let's think about that um, well, where would that be that was there we've got the log bridge we could take these out to a tower and then Hmm. Let's experiment. This guy, wood. And 20 of those. Let's go play. What if we did something like... Um, wood, stone, what do we want to use? Let's stone. I don't know how to get through. Okay, well, you're just going to have to wait for a while. Let's stone, um, hmm, no, didn't want to do that, there, let's give them a portal, out over here, let's do a little bit of fighting if we do that, and let's make sure that they can get from, well, from here for now, yeah, someone just fell. To... Where are they grabbing all that? Is it all done? We're under attack. I think it's all done. So we'll just stop right there. Attack him. And only if you're not ready to die, okay? Alright. Now, we have a portal here. We have a portal here. We're not any... What do we do right there? Let's control R and see what happens. And off they go. Did the beds get built? They did. And off they go. Aha! Control R is good. Now, over here, let's... Whoever's not sleeping, come over here and, and give them a hand. Turn that volume down. That's probably coming through the microphone. There, that might be better. Alright, so next. You're under attack over here. Well, hello! Let's go say hi to you. Interesting, the door's open and yet he won't go through it. It acts as a closed door to him, but an open door to them. That's good to know. As long as he doesn't bust through, I believe it goes back to 100% integrity afterward. Okay, so what I'm thinking is some kind of a tower. Which means we're going to have to get clever here. And do something like that. Ah, I didn't mean to be that far away. And so you can reach that, that, and that, maybe. Maybe not. Mm, that was a mistake. And then dirt. There. Now, who's... We're still under attack, huh? Where were you out here? You're probably collecting bones from the last one. 
but low health and immediately went to bed because he had a bed about time we got that figured out now any more loot on this side or can you guys stop going out now there's one more log that's where you're trying to get to all right go over there and get these done while you're at it and the sheep and the bush no more no more <laughs> You're sitting right there. You're sitting right there. Wait, remember, we could get rid of these and be done with them, but that's that's what we're here for. So I'm gonna play with play with ghouls. All right, so that's there, and yeah, we want to do one more. We got to kind of hurry up on this because now if I do that there, okay, let's stone. There, before I gotta hurry up before these portals go away, which I think it's pretty much already done. All right, do that. Stone. I'm thinking a ladder down the side and a bridge across, like so. I don't know that it's any different from putting just a, a bridge right or a ladder right up here. Except maybe we can come out here and bust the uh, the bridge apart if we have to. I don't know. Ah. Trying to do that, huh? Okay, let's do this. Right there is where I meant for this one to go. And no more f popping out of that one, okay? Two gold, 88 mana. What is our one? Uh, okay, we haven't done that one yet. Okay, let's, you guys play with that one. Well, let me see if I can or if I'm allowed to put these in yet. Are they smart enough to just build the one they can reach? All right, let's see what happens there. As well as, can I ladder right in front of? I think I can. Just like so. Alright, we're going to play with that system. See if that's good or if it's really not good. Alright, forge. Let's just pop a forge um, into... Where do I want? There? Yeah. Workbench. Forge. Where to? Beds are pretty much done for the moment, so we'll do that. Pop a forge into here just get it done and what else is needed to fulfill that particular uh, technology we're almost there let's make another axe and if we can nothing else right all right let's make another pick I didn't, I didn't do the axe I didn't click twice there we go so those two will complete it as soon as that's built, or we're back into here. Boy, I wish I could take care of him. All right, and control R one more time. Anybody else needs to heal up? Just, nope, we're fine. Now, the arrow, the, the archer book thing, that was kind of some confusion last time. What I'm gathering from that, let me get to uh, Floyd. I had put a bow onto him, but then I went and put a shield onto him, which kicked the, the bow out. So that's the reason why the bow wasn't there when I went back the other time. I didn't catch that the first time. But get rid of that. Put the bow back on. I don't know that he can use it until he has the archer book. The archer skill in his list here. Let's find out. Let's... Well, let's go ahead and him and live. Let's go ahead and do that again. Take this off, put this on, and let's see what happens long term. She's carrying it right now. Um, I wish I could. There she is. And she's got a bow on. Ooh. It worked. Without the archer book. She just went. I wonder if she will come down to take this one. Look at that. Ah. That was it. Okay. Um, don't remember the name of the of the uh, viewer who left that comment, but uh, I'll flash it up on the screen there. And thank you very much. That was really helpful. All right. So we have completed that one. Good. Let's take a look here. We're now heading into right there. All right. Let's do this. Though we already have the two bows. We don't want too many archers. I'm picturing maybe four out of the group as archers. So let's... Um, it says we already know it. Because we bought it, we know it. That's interesting. That's probably got to be done on the workbench, I'm going to guess. Arrows are going to take 
these, I would say yes. Yeah, let's... There, there, and... Feather. This one? Yeah. So that's... Well, feather or resin? What's, the, what's our limiter? Feathers are going to be the limiter. So we need lots of chickens. All right, so give me all of these that you can. Ooh, they make multiples. That's 10 each round. Okay. Um... Resin, what else do you do? Variety of lights. Okay, so I don't want to necessarily blow through all the feathers, though. What do, what do feathers do outside of arrows? Just for arrows. All right, then let's go ahead and make that our limiter. Let's just keep running the feathers out. Um, that was... I lost you. There? Yeah. And they've still got to be made. The little hammer right there means that they've still got to they've still got to build those. Um, simple arrows are infinite. We don't know the silver arrows yet. Okay. So in that case, let's go ahead and max this out. Go there. Make them all. And back to you. All right. So they're going to just make arrows like crazy. And that is done here. So we can put our forge back in. Remove Forge. Let's go back down here where we're supposed to be. And Liv and Floy are both not doing a very good job. <laughs> Alright, if you were to go lower... No, you went down and got scared. But it's like you're hitting the dirt. Take the dirt out. I think they're hitting the dirt. I think the game is blocking them. Now can you do it? Yeah, that arrow just fell. That was stuck in the dirt. Here we go. Attack him, guys. Attack him. Um, nobody? He's like right there. Well, our archers will continue to back up to uh, keep getting a good shot. All right, so that solves that. And before we... Let's see, we can get rid of these. You know, I'm going to do this. Let's fill these back in. And with these ladders. And then let's put more ladders up. Craft ladders. And that's the end of the wood. Okay. Ladders. Let's go here and there. All right. Let's get these filled back in. Let's take these out. And let's put a layer of dirt right there. So we've got a much better chance of reaching above this forge. Okay. So that's starting to clean that mess up. Once that is all done, this can come out, remove. Where next? I We're almost done there. Let's get more stone in here. We can do that now without portals. Build stone. Good. Just to make it a little bit stronger. And let's clear all of this out. Wow. That's right. They will fall off of these. Um, craft. Log bridge. Not very reliable. Yeah. So that is one problem. We get to the uh, the better quality bridges later. And that will make a difference. But let's take this out. Let's swap these for stone instead. And get the forest growing out of ground level. So that Mr. Catapult doesn't have even more leverage. More distance. This needs to go away. And this needs to be stone. Build stone. Okay. Um, actually, that's right. I can just swap out. So, we replace wooden wall with stone. This goes away. And, like so, and like so. And that gets us to the roof, so we don't need this ladder here anymore. Same thing here. Remove. What else? Doors. So, locks. So, iron. Aha. And wood. Now, wood is happening over here and we could because we do have a problem with the uh, the unreliability of our chosen mode of transportation there <laughs> as a mouthful um, I'll go ahead and just give them a portal and for that matter let's take that out that out you out and that tree we are needing wood right now so let's get these going chicken feathers equal arrows and for that matter let's take that row off and start taking that down to closer to water level there 
You're under attack right there, that's fine. Uh, this tree can go away. And... I wonder if they have a certain skill that will work. You can do that, huh? I didn't think so. That will allow them to walk this easier. Um, get rid of you. You, you. Get rid of you. You are under attack. I'm still after this guy. Okay. And take those out. Yeah, I like that. Alright, you, you, and you. Let's clear these out. And let's start uh, replacing. Replace front. Okay. Uh, cut down, not gather. Alright. Clear these out. The grass will start to grow over the top, and pretty soon we'll be, be uh, watching a new forest show up. Speaking of show, uh, forest show up, seems like there was... Now, a couple years ago, I used to play this game a lot. I've got close to uh, right, right around 500 hours logged into it, but a couple of years away from a game, and you really kind of lose what you knew. There was a spell, kind of like the portal spell, that grew trees. It grew forest, we'll put it that way, every every kind of plant. You just place it over an area and, and a whirlwind goes through and everything starts to grow like crazy. wonder where that was, when we're going to come across it. Of course, now that we have this thing, these weren't here when I was playing before. So there were just, you know, there weren't as many, the technology wasn't as uh, prolific as this. There was enough, to, there were five available and they filled up one of these and it was done. Now we've got too many to fit on one. So I could be looking for it and never find it because it's behind one of these. So may as well just give up that one. Anyway, clear those out. That's growing in the right place. And under attack right there is fine. We're going to have another nighttime coming. So 20 minutes left till that attack. I don't want that in this episode. I want to start next episode with that. So I need to give these guys lots of things to do and then kind of head out. So let's clear out that and we'll do that place iron uh, put that in there so we can take this out all right and yeah same pattern over there and then we'll do something like that over here and let's fill this in about to say we should be under attack here real soon okay Oops, not there. <laughs> Lost it. Okay, well, whatever it was, it was short-lived. Short-lived for somebody. Hello. Okay. Although, that might be a problem. We're going to have a battle out here, balancing on a log. Yeah. We're going to do this successfully? Nope, we're getting out of the... Oh, let's live. Okay. And there's Floyd. And he's going to run past. Come get me! Well, that's the problem. Okay, so I can't get inside. Though we could have our battles here instead of here. That could still work. Have our battles up here instead of down there, so that if they do break in, we still have lots of room to, to attack them to defend the place. Okay, I can kind of see this. It is nice that the archers will run back, though. And get someone with shields out there in front while they're still shooting through them. They don't shoot each other. Just, they don't have to worry about that. But I see that with this being this far away, they're not willing to go out here to go down. They'd rather do this and then go back up. Aha. Uh -huh. So there's not as much advantage here as I thought there was. Okay. Well, in that case, I guess we're just going to do this. Out of ladder. Hmm. Okay. That's a problem. Let's get rid of these. Remove, 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 and remove. And we'll put one of them right... Click and hold there. Right there to finish these off. Okay, and there's another one. Now, mark you for, for uh, elimination right now. Liv, take care of them, please. Thank you. 
Although he may come after her. If he does and he gets down low enough, I wish the others would all come in. Who is under... What? No, 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 no. Ah, you guys just have a ball. You're not going to get through. So in that case... Oh, I'd like to get rid of this then. This didn't work. <laughs> hmm. Well, first of all, let's do this. Start at the ground level. And then these are eventually going to get hauled back and dropped into inventory, but we've got to... You chose to go around like this to go up there. Why? Um, if you're going to do that, then yeah, fine. We'll, uh, we'll get rid of that. While you're standing on it. Uh, huh? Oh, you're good. You're real good. <laughs> Break it and grab the one up. No, nope, you fell that time. Okay. Well, in that case, if you insist on going around, then we're going to go around. All right. So somebody take these out so I can have that ladder back. Otherwise, we'll put these ladders in here. And then how do we... Let's just eliminate that one. How do we get rid of this without them falling? Without using four portal spells? Huh. Well, we will ladder here, and we will break that one, and we'll just let that sit there and look good for a while. Yep, I think so. Let's look at ground level here. Hmm. I was off by one. Okay, well, this one will then put the... Yeah, we'll, we'll mirror it. We'll put dirt along the back of all of it. Which we're going to have to portal to get them into here. We'll do that. Uh, not you. And then we will stone in front of this one. You walked all the way over here. Why? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> And then I guess we will ladder up this one as well. We'll just have to make this far more defensible. So, put a stone. Nope. Right there. Why can't I replace that? Oh, it replaced the back side of it. It didn't replace the front. Okay, we're going to have to manually remove that. Alright. You're going to go there. You're going to go there and there. Like that. Okay, that works. And then we're going to continue, well, with dirt in the back, stone in the front, and wood in front of that. Yeah, I guess I... Yeah, that's just... No, oh, okay, that's the back layer. Yeah, I can get away with that. They, they can't build themselves into that. Okay, so that'll be there. Yeah. And then, did we get down to any iron yet? That's all silver. This is iron over here. Let's get some more of this going. When we're all done, this whole thing's going to be mined out. It's going to be quite impressive down here. Uh, need to get lots of lighting in here, though. Let's... Well, we got a spider in there. Let's light that one up. Kill order on the spider. Clean these guys out. We'll get leaves out of them. They don't, uh, I don't think they fight back. They look like it, but I think they're actually pretty harmless. And I guess let's just, I was thinking about busting this out, but I think we'll leave it as a walkway. Place coal and nothing behind, nothing behind, okay. This one's gonna come out right now anyway. In fact, she was the one that took out the other one when uh, when the larva went after her. Hopefully somebody wanders down this way. Nope. So she's on her own. Whoa, mice. Little mice. No, oh, big rats. Grab all of the crystals. There, stuff we will use later. This gives them lots of practice with their swords and we get 
meat and other things from the rats. So they, they drop loot for us. Waiting for one to actually go down. Of course they do bite back too. There's a leather. Thought there was a slab there's a slab of meat. Yeah, we get we get stuff from them. And they're not too difficult, so we may as well go ahead and, and just keep the keep doing that. Here's a bunch of arrows they've been working on. Oh the arrows are coming out of here, not the forge. Okay. Under attack. Okay, that's that one. And new task? What's it want now? It wants to start basically glass, it looks like. And this is the bow and arrow group. And to collect sand. Am I reading that right? 12,000 points of experience for collecting 10 sand. Now that's a little bit over kill there. That's weird. Okay, just saying. So let's take you guys out, you guys out, and we'll fill these all back in with dirt. Uh, let's replace these guys. Replace uh, rear, replace rear, replace rear, replace rear, and replace rear. Okay, take you out. All right, we'll grab sand. Grab those, all of those, and that. Now, sand will collapse on you, if I remember right. You know, I'm going to take that back. I don't know that now. It might. It does in most every game, but I can't honestly remember now whether it does in this particular game or not. Anyway, what do we got? I've got, what, another ten minutes or so of this episode. The rats made it all the way up here, or this is yet another one? This is another one. Probably one for each totem now. And speaking of totems, I just remembered that this needs to be centered. He has a radius around him. So many, so much distance, you'll see it kind of clips off over here. Although it does a pretty good job. I'm thinking he's going to be more right in here, between the two what are going to be towers when we're done. Um, if you would hop off of here, I could click on the base. Take you, there, got it. And that's enough for now. Okay, food? Ooh, food is gone. Eggs? And a salad. And steak. Alright. You remove, remove, and remove, and remove. Let's dirt back into there. Alright, let's forge back into here. Do that. And later we'll build a chest and put it in between just because it looks good. Um, although I didn't dirt into this. Nope, you go away. I want to fill this in more dense. And let's get another ladder right there. I think we can reach it all from here. Okay, that takes care of that. More door. Gotta deal with that. Let's take those out. Or let's just stone replace front earth. Okay, you're gonna go there. You're going to build stone. Um, you're removing. We're going to build stone here. And build stone, build stone. Build stone, build stone. And eventually we're going to put a door right there. Whatever comes out, we'll deal with it one at a time. Though that's not the best place. We better <clears throat> not be doing this on a ladder. Let's... <clears throat> yeah, he's in trouble. He's going to get knocked off his ladder over and over again. <clears throat> Come on, guys. There you go. Give him a hand. Oops, oops, oops. Yeah, ladders can be bad. If we landed in water... Ooh. I like that. I don't think they get hurt if they land in water. You can still jump that. Interesting. Yeah, he didn't land in water, did he? <laughs> hmm. And dwarves will drown in that little square right there, trust me. <laughs> um, I think we're taking you out 
we're going to replace you with stone. And we're going, actually both of them, replace roots. Take you out, and you out, and you out, and we're going to pull these out, and let this fill up with water. And when we get knocked off, we have someplace safe to land. That sound like a plan? We're trying to get out of this. Let's take more of this out. Alright, we're under attack somewhere else. We found the sand. Boy, and yet 12,000 points did what, one third of us? Yeah. Alright, take those out. We're definitely going to use all this sand. This is going to become glass. So we'll put dirt back in its place. And we'll grab a, a wild boar while we can. And we need to get to where we're making mana potions soon, because they're going to get quite expensive. Where is that? What do we have to do to get there? Hmm, it's nowhere soon, that's for sure. This is where we're going. going to make uh, glass and jars and bottles of oil and clay. And all these will be used to make other things further on. Um, where are the potions? And are they obvious? Fishing... Advance, I think military's toward the bottom, right? Armor. So it'll be down in here. That's the fireball spell. There's Vapa's dynamite. Here's the diving helmet. I was mentioning an episode or two ago. Where they can go down into water and, and do things. <clears throat> Iron fences. Somewhere in here is the much better bridge, too. Where is that coming up? There. Wooden bridge. And much more reliable. Then there's a stone version of it. Rather than a swinging um, uh, logs on vines kind of a thing. But there, that's what I want. So to get to here, basic alchemy. Got to head across the top end here. And I'm not actually seeing anything as dependent upon anything else. I just need to get this done. What do we need to do? We've done a whole bunch of arrows. So let's get a wooden staff built, which means glass. Okay, let's get glass going. Glass is a lot of coal. Arr, yeah. And sand. Coal is going to be used for a lot of things. So that's going to be one of those things we're going to run out of quite quick. Let's do 20. Ah, we're going to use a lot of glass. We'll do... 40. Okay, that hurt. Um, so 40 glass, and it's still got to be made, if I'm correct. That's there. Yeah, they've still got to make that. And that is made where? I'm assuming the workshop. But it, well, it might be the forge. you got to melt glass. That would make sense if they're going to build it down here. Yeah. You can come out? Yes, you can come out. don't know why you haven't yet. And... What else... What do we need to really get into soon? If you got any thoughts, let me know of high priority things to do before. Well, not much we're gonna else we're gonna get done. Other than equip some more bows, could do that. Uh, replace your under attack. Replace stone. No, build stone. Just got to thinking. Equip. Let's turn off. Let's see. First of all, we don't have any archer books. Correct. <clears throat> Did. Floy suddenly developed the archer skill. No. And live? No. Okay. But they can use the bow and arrow. And that was my confusion last time. So, but she doesn't have the armor that she that the others do. Because it doesn't have the shield anymore. Let's pick um, one more to be an archer. Who best? I think somebody who will be inside. A cook would be great. Don't actually have a cook assigned, do we? Alright, a miller, a cook, and you're going to be an archer. That is Helene. So, there, right there, the shield fell off, and I want her to not use simple arrows. I wonder, will they use these... Let's leave that on. I wonder if they will use these in one... 
they run out they'll use those or you have to actually tell them to use them i'll have to wait and see if the fire arrows suddenly start getting used we will see that with this battle coming up which i want to shut down at five minutes till so we're going to be ending this episode real soon here okay there's floy and they weren't checked okay where's Liv? they're not automatically checked all right so bows all right that's why we haven't been seeing them okay uh replace you with stone replace earth and we need a door eventually though i'd really like to have these gone before we have that happen again but um can't get there okay that goes away then that gets built but it'd be nice to get a steel door into actually this end over here so we're not fighting on a ladder that bothers me let's take you guys out and let's i can't do that can i replace stone only i can go here build earth and then we'll ladder down from there. Give us a little bit of a space. They can come down the ladder, shoot through the door. Okay, I'm kind of seeing that. Um, five minutes left. Let's do this and be done. At least get it going. Dirt into these spaces. Like so. We'll do those as well. Didn't get back to this... Um, I do need locks for those doors. Let's get those happening. One, two. And the doors are there. So craft two of those. Drop that into there. You're going to go there and there for now. And let's... I can't reverse it till I build it, huh? Yeah. Okay. So, are we kind of done for right now? That's the easy way in. Don't have an easy way in here because I don't have enough ladders. We'll do that. Craft. Do I have any wood left? I do. Okay. Alright. From this end to that end, they will eventually get that done. Let's give them some more dirt. And that's all done. Alright. P. Pause. Alright, I think I'm done. Done with this episode. So, Forge is up and running again. Bow and arrows are going again, though we don't have any skills in them. And we're starting to get down a little bit deeper here. Nothing seems, well, okay, I take that back. This continues down. Interesting little stair thing going on there. These are interesting too, but there's a gem associated with them. So I'm guessing there's a monster down in here we haven't seen yet. Otherwise, we're seeing any new metals. We've got silver, which is stacking up down here. We've got iron, and we've got coal mixed in here somewhere. Need to get sideways. Interesting. So we have coal over here. Need to probably get off in this direction. Come right across this whole swath here. This is where the railroad will come in later. Be kind of handy. I don't even know where that is. There's a whole category dedicated to railroad. Right over here. Well, we got to go a long way before we get to all this stuff. You know, some really exciting weapons over here. So, yeah, there's a long way to go. This is going to be quite a series. And back to pause, and let's call this one done. This has been Noble Rambler. Thanks, guys, for watching. And looks like a battle next time. Bye-bye.